Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general love reading for my friends Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, we are going for something a bit different from the usual quick readings to change things up a little, but always in the love arena. So let's find out what's coming through for you. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what we can get for you guys. And here we go, we have a flyer, so we are ready. Your energies, guys, six of wands, queen of wands, your person's energies, hierophant, ten of pentacles, wow, three of swords, and the high priestess, meeting of the energies, bottom of the deck, knight of pentacles. So this is meaningful for those of you that may have the chance to pursue, um, a committed partnership and look at this ace of pentacles energy bottom of the night exactly the type of energy that the knight of pentacles is holding in his hand he is holding the ace of pentacles so i would say um, to start the reading i will address immediately the three of swords because it can be an energy past related because we see the warrior that comes back from the battle victorious in your side of energies so this can be true for some of you but it can be true also for some of, you, of your persons because they are extremely uh, partnership oriented you know hierophant ten of pentacles this is um, this is quite um, quite a desire for them they may have already tried they can they can be someone that has already been married but for whatever reason meeting energies it may um, it may be something that didn't work before then major intuition with the a priestess energy getting in touch with the higher power the higher self to um, acquire knowledge and despite the challenges, we can learn lessons. And I feel this can be quite a learning curve, quite a learning process. Because this new opportunity, because we have seen the Ace of Pentacles, a brand new beginning, related to the fact that the both of you may take your time to evaluate if this new uh, partnership can be truly the one that you were looking for. And you will be guided to recognize if some factor uh, can be a resemblance of previous sources of disappointment because the three of swords is an energy about sadness uh, regrets heartaches heartbreaks truly a heavy energy i will not make circles about the three of swords because it is what it is um, but again past related in this flow of energies the the warrior that comes back from the battle victorious is someone brave someone that is willing and able to overcome challenges the three of swords can be a battle on an energy level so as some of you may have gone through challenges you may have overcome them you may have learned quite a lot along the process the six of wands is a, an auspicious positive energy aimed at the future because it is about success moving forward um, victory triumph and so uh, there is also a recognition that you may have already achieved for you but at the same time a recognition that can be um, something that comes from the people around you and this can be the case considering the fact that some of your persons may have recognized that you are 
quite amazing indeed because the Queen of Wands is a beautiful energy, extremely self-confident. The Queen is in touch with her intuition because she has a black cat as a best friend. So she is able to pay attention to all the factors that are involved in whatever type of situation uh, she may face and she knows how to navigate within every interaction in a productive way plus she is extremely attractive she can be extremely uh, sought after highly sought after you know quite popular I would say but because of the Knight of Pentacles energy there is no rush for some of you and also for some of your persons no rush to jump into uh, connections that are not the one that you were looking for the beautiful power of the priestess will facilitate because it will offer guidance in this case the high priestess is not about silence even if it is a meaning of the major arcana this is an ability to get in touch with the higher self because the high priestess knows everything but she speaks only the essentials and it's kind of like the both of you are able to bring to the table the topics within the conversations that you can share that can be about the, the, the desires that you want to fulfill in a love partnership. This person is thinking long term because the Ten of Pentacles is an energy about legacy, a family opportunity, the chance to... Uh, build a partnership that can stand the test of time because there are shared values within it you know so solid foundations and this is the chance to take care and provide for the needs of all those involved in this auspicious scenario if your person is the one that for example was married before it didn't work for whatever reason they have embraced the learning process you know uh, kind of evaluating all the aspects involved in the adventure and they have um, learned because the hierophant is about lessons also about partnerships in this case no doubts uh, so structured connections solid grounds and knowing about what is important within this type of interactions this is a very spiritual energy they can truly grant in favor of the opportunity to establish love partnership uh, a huge importance this person it can be important for them despite the fact that they may have tried and uh, maybe it didn't work but um, again choices um, how can we manifest a goal so a partnership for example in a way that can be reliable trustworthy uh, solid in a way that can stand the test of time paying attention to all the factors involved this is something that some of you may truly like because if you are indeed highly sought after you may know it or not but channeling Queen of Wands energy uh, it's one of the <laughs> it's one of the aspects you can truly recognize a loyal, honest and sincere energy um, within the interactions uh, with this person and vice versa because they can truly appreciate your mindset for example the Knight of Pentacles again reliable, trustworthy, honest the slowest knight in the deck we can agree but it will power through the finish line even if it may take a little bit more time than the other nights and we are kinda looking at an opportunity to 
establish a partnership that can go the distance the both of you can be uh, strengthened by the previous experiences there is a knowing and intuitively guided recognition about this opportunity even a chance for healing and the three of swords can be for example a productive topic uh, to discuss together by saying the things that didn't work before the things that we do not want to experience moving forward so that the field is extremely clear no space for guesses we are crystal clear from the very beginning for example and then we kind of know how to uh, navigate throughout the building up of the partnership long term this person sees the opportunity to uh, go the distance basically so guys i will leave it at that i hope you it was helpful i'll continue on vimeo see you there if you want to join me the link is below let us know if you resonate comment like share and subscribe to the channel until next time guys i wish you the best take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye